If you want to grow your coaching or consulting business, you have to recognize if you're stuck in the operator role and figure out how to start functioning as the CEO of your business. Hey, this is Laura Agachega, founder and CEO of Viral Growth Media. And in today's video, we're going to talk about a challenge that most, if not all, business owners go through and how to move from business operator to the CEO of your company and why it's necessary if you want your business to grow. And before we get ahead of ourselves, please make sure to subscribe to our channel and click that notification button so you don't miss out on any of our content on digital marketing, scaling, growth, and so much more. And we'd really appreciate it if you could give this video a like and a comment. And let's be real, okay? So it's just a reality and it's perfectly okay. You know, when you're first starting out your business, you wear a lot of hats and most of those hats involve running and operating your business. So that's fine. You're a small business. You won't have a full team at the get-go, right? Like at the start of it all. And not all of us have endless resources. However, you have to make sure that you don't get stuck in this role if you want your business to grow. So let's define first what I mean when I ask if you're a CEO or a business operator. So a business operator is the one working in the business. They are the ones who supervise, overlook everything technical, administrative, that has something to do with the business or even sometimes just perform it themselves. This is everything from customer service, marketing, sales, accounting, logistics, and really even HR and basically anything that has to do with running daily business operations. So the day to day, and let's be real, it's a lot. So a CEO on the other hand works on the business, right? Their job is to make sure that the company is moving towards its vision and goals and making high level decisions on what ideas or strategies to pursue in order for the business to grow. Now, if you're a small business and you're wearing both of these hats and, and you're just stuck in the operator role, you know, your business may be running just fine, but no one is actually directing it towards growth. So you're just stuck at the same level. And, and growth doesn't just mean gaining new customers or generating revenue. It's also about running a more efficient company, handling your finances better and keeping up with the trends and changes in your industry. And if you're just stuck in the operator role, then new businesses could eventually just catch up to you and run you out of the way. I want you to do this. Okay. Take a look at your calendar, you know, your to-do list and your agendas right now. Is there anything there that, you know, has to do with growing your business or are they all about running your business? So if the answer is the latter, then you have to start making changes. And, and I suggest you clear a time out of your day, even just one day a week to really think about strategies and ideas on how you can move your business closer to your original vision and towards growth. And and if you can't find even a couple of hours out of your schedule to do that, then guess what? You're probably overwhelmed and you need to start seriously considering hiring another person on your team. It's your first hire. I highly recommend as an executive assistant. And if you want to learn more about moving from a business operator to a CEO in your own company, you can book a complimentary call with us. VGM, Viral Growth Media specializes in helping small businesses and solo entrepreneurs in the coaching and consulting space scale their businesses and we do a lot of work in helping owners and entrepreneurs assume the role of CEOs of their own businesses so that they can actually move towards growth. So I'm going to leave a link below where you can actually schedule a call and we can walk you through that process. So thanks for watching this video. Leave us a comment below on what you want to see next. I'll see you guys in the next video.